Namaste. Welcome back to Yoga's Poses. As you can see, when I practice yoga, I like to practice right out in nature. Yoga is about finding your center and involves meditation. Nature helps me find my center. It doesn't matter where you practice yoga. If you find you want to practice yoga in the studio, that's great. But you can also practice in your living room, in the comfort of your own home, on your deck, in your own backyard. Because yoga is for everyone, anywhere. In the last video, we learned about the locust. Now, while the energy is still flowing, let's learn about the bow. Today, I feel blessed as we share space with the Loon family. A mama and about 10 babies are floating on by. They're so beautiful and I feel graced by their presence. Now for the bow pose. We want to start by lying face down. Start by bending your knees and grab a hold of your ankles if you can. This pose is called the bow because it looks like an archer's bow, the torso and the legs representing the body of the bow and the arms as the string. Arch into the bow by pulling on the ankles. While you push the feet out and up, this will arch the back, just like a bow. Remember to keep breathing deeply and hold for three breaths if you can, then lower down your head. Please do not force this, but do what you can and keep practicing. The bow helps to open the pelvis. If you can, stretch a bit further and rock your body to receive the full benefits of this pose. Bow pose engages all of your back muscles as you reach back to grab your ankles, strengthening the back and improving posture and mobility. Bow pose opens your shoulders from the front of the body, relieving tightness and reducing slouching. And with many yoga poses, it can improve your posture. Today, I feel blessed as we share this space with the Loon family. Thank you, Loon family. So today you learned about the bow and it is actually a counter position to the next position, which will be the child's pose. I hope you join us for that. And until next time, remember, yoga, it's about you.